What is going on guys, Sir Lewis here. Welcome to your daily Doge update. And wow, what are the last couple of days? It's been amazing for Dogecoin. As you guys can see, 17 cents at the moment. And I think this is the first time ever that I do daily Doge where we actually have some news to talk about for Doge. That's big enough to talk about. And that is the fact that Coinbase launches Doge futures soon. But it's not just a fact that they're launching Dogecoin futures is what they said about Dogecoin. And I'm going to get to this in a few seconds. But before that, um, we can see that on the weekly, Dogecoin is up 15%, which is actually, when you look at the big picture, is actually pretty good in the top 100, up 15% versus the other meme coins. Like, you know, Bonk is down 11%, Whiff is down 5%, Floki is actually up 5%, and Shib is up 3%. So, Dogecoin outperforming the other meme coins. And to be honest, I kind of feel like Dogecoin, especially with what Coinbase said, which I'm going to get to in a few seconds, I kind of feel like Dogecoin is like the Bitcoin of the meme coins. I feel like it's the first mover, and then the other meme coins are going to start moving um, right after. Because I, I think Dogecoin was actually the first mover this time. Yeah, It made that first move, and then Shiba later, I don't know if it was at the same time, but I, I think Shiba came a little later, and then the other coins too. So yeah um but let's take a look at the charts let's take a look at the charts uh and let's take a look at this article and by the way in my discord guys there's gonna be i'm trying to make this the best crypto discord ever with a bunch of features that are actually like it makes you want to come to it there's gonna be a reason why you want to come to the discord daily and i'm uh, the one of the features is that right here in the news section you click on news and I have this spot. I put in the spot that every single time one of these three coindesk, crypto news.com, telegraph, what is it? Coin telegraph. These are huge crypto news, only crypto news websites. And every single time they post even faster than, than Twitter, the next.com, every single time they post on their site, boom, right here in the, in the discord, you just scroll down. This is the latest, the latest news. Every time it just posts right here, automatic super fast with the spot so you'll be up to date even faster than twitter so um that is going to be a that's a feature that i've added to the discord which is again 100 percent free and it's coming out in um this month and the, if you want to enter the the giveaway it's 115 dollars first prize 28 dollars second prize it's in the pin comment okay free money i'm giving out um in this giveaway you guys can enter it for your favorite crypto but getting on to the article, Coinbase to launch Doge Futures. And well, look what they said. I'm going to read the full thing of what they said. This is what they said. Official. Like Coinbase officially said this. Um, Dogecoin's enduring popularity and the active community. They're talking about us. Okay, I know they're talking about us there. But um, support suggests that it has transcended its origins as a meme to become a staple a staple, I'm repeating that, the staple of the cryptocurrency world. This is what Coinbase thinks about Dogecoin, guys. Right? The biggest crypto you know, exchange in America, I would say, right? They have they're in the stock exchange. Be, so this is uh this is amazing. And this is the main reason why I believe Dogecoin has been up here 15% on the weekly, coming back to 17 cents from 12 cents. And you can see right here, I'm submitting uh, the listing for Dogecoin futures contract to be offered for trading on exchange after April 1st. So after April 1st. So, you know, this is definitely could April, could by April 1st Dogecoin be above 20 cents. We'll take a look at the charts, but this is very bullish, right? And especially Coinbase being the first one doing this. We can see Kraken later and the other ones do it as well. Um, but... Let's take a look at the charts because I know that's what you guys are also here for. Taking a look at the charts. Now, I've been seeing some comments. Someone commented and saying that, oh, you know, when you do the Fibonacci, it's swing high to swing low. Like, you know, you got to get from this low. To... Listen, I understand. Like, I, 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 I get it. You know, that's more for like the short term. And I'll do that as well. But when you were looking at my last video when I was showing the Fibonacci, it was from the bear market low to the all time highs. Okay, and doing it this way, I do it this way because it gives you a long-term perspective. It gives you a long-term perspective, and the Fibonacci's are actually very, very accurate. Okay, but yes, if I'm gonna show you here later on the video the short-term getting from the swing low to 
the swing high here and we'll take a look here at the short term to see how it's doing but this is very don't do not um neglate this the bear market low fibonacci to the all-time highs because this gives us targets to where dogecoin and it gave us this target okay just to show you that how accurate it is it gave us this target where dogecoin clear rejection off of that 0.5 which it did last same thing last last uh pre bull market with the same way the fibonacci is used bear market low to all-time high and right there um so but looking at the price action we're actually um dogecoin is actually held at 618 which i tell you guys all the time that 618 okay if we are bullish we're gonna get a bounce off that 618 if we are bearish we're gonna lose that 618 and come down further so so far dogecoin is looking very very bullish now last video i talked about dogecoin coming down to that 0.78 near 10 cents 11 cents and listen i still believe it can okay just because we're having this big um with this decent push up here does not mean that we can't come down here the reason why i said this is because i'll show you guys again last pre bull market we did something like this which we can still do it's this is what we did we you know we first went up rejected at 0.5 okay it came down um and then we kind of curved down to dump and then later curved to go back up and break all the all the levels all the fib levels that's what we did last pre bull market and i'll show you guys proof um so this is why i still believe that dogecoin can kind of curve curve and then dump you know even to the point 70 wouldn't be like i said if it comes to 11 cents range I am gonna I'm gonna buy a good amount. I already bought a amount a good amount when it was here at 12 cents. And if you guys follow my daily dojo updates, I told you guys I was buying at 12 cents as well in the telegram. Um and I'm happy I bought. But if we do have a curve down, a dump down to 11 cents, 10 cents, 9 cents, I do not look, I do not believe we'll break that that 0.78. I don't break I don't believe we'll break nine cents. I don't think Dogecoin will go back to eight cents. Okay. So Anywhere around here, I think is a great target. But if we are different this time, and we are actually very, very bullish, and, and Bitcoin starts to go back up to break its all-time highs, um, well, we, this is definitely um, we could definitely do something like this, right? Dogecoin can definitely do something like that, which would mean its next target is that twenty-eight, twenty-seven cents. Okay, but I believe that we are gonna do something similar to last pre bull market maybe even just come here to that point instead of coming to that point 78 right maybe we could just come here to that point 70 which honestly would be very bullish because we're creating a higher low a good higher low from the previous higher low which is around 11 cents slightly under 12 cents like i said and i honestly you guys gotta understand the more down we go the more strength we have to blast through fib levels so if this happens, I can see Dogecoin moving really, really fast. Like in a matter of weeks or days, it's going to break through 19, 28 and come up here to that point 23, which is around 40 cents, 40 cents. Okay. And this is what it did last bear market. It, it last pre bull market. It just, once it did that higher low and it, it started to curve back up, it just broke through that 0 0.5, 0 0.38 and went to that point 23. To 40 cents and i'm going to show you guys right here how correlated we are to this okay and and for that for the person that's been telling me about the fib level swing look yes so we get right here this is for the short term okay but i'm giving you guys here the long term perspective but we can see that we actually bounce off that 0.5 which is pretty bullish our next target is right there at 26 cents so which is about what i said 28 cents if we are bullish but let's take a look here also at last pre bull market to show you guys how similar we are so we get the bear market low right there look at that look look, look at that guys look at that you see that huge wick to 0.5 it's the same exact move this is the same exact move like i said this is why this is i'm giving you fibonacci on the long-term perspective here very boring bear market bear market and then what what happens the first the first major move we come up here to that 0.5 we get rejected there the same exact thing like I can't make this up the same exact thing that happened this pre bull market. But guess what happens? This is the difference. We come down, we we lose that 618, okay? 
and, and the 618 this time for this time period was that 0.70 we lose that 0.70 curve down right we actually break that 0.78 but we we create this very bullish curve here to come back up and break through all these fib levels you can see we get rejected right there again at 0.5 but then very fast we break through and we come up here to our first resistance point which is that 0 0.23 which is what i talked about 40 cents and once we get up here we only stay up here for one to four weeks right and then we break through it so we can definitely short squeeze to 40 cents stay there for a couple weeks one or two weeks and then break through that okay i'm just giving you guys here what dogecoin could possibly do not financial advice i'm not saying this will happen and like i said i'm prepared for any scenario i bought when it was 12 cents okay and i'm probably buy again when it's around 12 cents 11 cents again but i'm not saying it could go down there because if we are very bullish here which we, it looks like we are holding that 618 we can definitely short squeeze to 28 cents all right so yeah guys um hope you guys like the daily doge update definitely follow for more if you're new comment below uh i have a free telegram the discord is coming this month and to enter the free telegram just check out the pinned comment entering the giveaway because you get four entries for entering um the free telegram which again i'm super active on when i'm not live i'm on there okay right here this is the telegram we already got over 323 members which is awesome and i'm really active on here um as you guys can see and you'll be up to date with everything what i'm buying what i'm selling and all that so thank you guys so much love you guys and, and yeah i'll catch you guys in my next live or video peace